Immerse yourself in the captivating history of Didem and Kusadasi, two remarkable cities in Turkey with a past as rich as their present. Born from the cradle of civilization, Didim and Kusadasi have seen the rise and fall of empires, bearing witness to countless turning points in history. In the ancient world, these cities held significant strategic value as bustling port cities, serving as gateways to the Aegean Sea. Over the millennia, they've transformed, embracing change and yet preserving their historical essence. Today, they stand not only as thriving urban centers, but also as popular tourist destinations, drawing in history buffs and adventure seekers alike with their enchanting blend of the old and the new. From ancient ruins to bustling markets, from serene beaches to lively nightlife, Didim and Kusadasi offer a tapestry of experiences that echo the narratives of their storied past. Now that we've set the stage with a bit of history, let's move on to explore the historical places these cities have to offer. Didim, a city that whispers tales from the past, is home to several historical landmarks, each with its unique story. Let's start our journey with the Temple of Apollo, a monument that stands as a testament to the city's ancient roots. This colossal temple, dating back to the 3rd century BC, was dedicated to Apollo, the Greek god of light, music and prophecy. A walk through its imposing columns is like stepping back in time, surrounded by echoes of ancient chants and rituals. Moving on, we find ourselves in the ancient city of Miletus, once one of the most significant cities in the Ionian League. Today, its well-preserved theatre and the Baths of Faustina stand as silent witnesses to the city's past glory. Miletus was also the birthplace of several renowned philosophers, including Thales, often considered the first philosopher in the Greek tradition. Finally, we reach the sacred site of Didyma, where the ancient Greeks consulted their oracles. This place was not a city but a sanctuary, its main feature being the Temple of Apollo, considered one of the most significant oracle sites in the ancient world. The sacred spring where pilgrims cleansed themselves before consulting the oracle still flows today, adding an air of mysticism to the site. From the grandeur of the Temple of Apollo to the mystical allure of Didyma, Didim is a treasure trove of historical gems. From Didim, we journey to Kusadasi, another city steeped in history. Our first stop is the ancient city of Ephesus, which thrived in the first century BC. This city was an important centre for early Christianity, and its grandeur still echoes today in its well-preserved ruins. Walking through its marble-paved streets, one can almost hear the whispers of the ancients. Next, we venture to the Basilica of St. John, built in the 6th century as a tribute to the Apostle John. This imposing structure with its columns reaching towards the sky is believed to be built over the tomb of St. John himself. It's a perfect example of the Byzantine architecture that was prevalent during the time. Our final stop is the House of Virgin Mary, a sacred site for both Christians and Muslims. Nestled atop Bulbul Mountain, this humble abode is believed to be the final residence of Mary, Mother of Jesus. The tranquility and spiritual energy of this place can be felt as soon as one steps through its stone archway. Each of these landmarks tells a unique tale of Kusadasi's past. From the bustling streets of ancient Ephesus to the solemn silence of St. John's Basilica and the peaceful serenity of Virgin Mary's house, Kusadasi offers a myriad of historical experiences. Kusadasi, with its ancient ruins and sacred sites, truly is a testament to the rich tapestry of history that Turkey has woven over the centuries. From ancient temples to sacred sites, Didim and Kusadasi have offered us a glimpse into the past. These cities, steeped in history, have opened a door to a world that once was, revealing stories etched in stone and whispered through the ages. In Didim, the grandeur of the Temple of Apollo stands as a testament to the city's historical significance, while Kusadasi's Pigeon Island Fortress is a silent sentinel of the city's maritime past. Each site, each ruin, each artifact is a piece of a vast historical puzzle, painting a vibrant picture of civilizations that thrived here centuries ago. These places are not just monuments of stone and mortar, they are living chronicles bearing witness to the passage of time, the rise and fall of empires, the ebb and flow of cultures. They are the footprints of our ancestors, etched into the fabric of our shared human story. As we conclude our journey, 
We hope this exploration of Didim and Kusadasi has ignited a spark of interest in the rich and fascinating history of these Turkish cities.